Number one is Interesting Eagle, owned by Steve Burns, Guadalupe Buhanda, and trainer Jose Flores in partnership. The rider is Erasmo Gasco. Number two, Challenger, raced by Bobby Cox, trained by Heath Taylor and ridden by Jose Nicasio. Number three, Don Lazaro, raced by Gildardo Garcia, prepared by Adan Farias. The rider is Adrian Loza. Four, remember my prize in the colours of E.G. High Desert Farms. Santos Perez is the trainer. Salvador Ibarra is entrusted with the mount. Five, J. La Sultana, owned by Antonio Fernandez Chetragui, trained by Jaime Gomez and ridden by Oscar Peinado. Six, K.R. Rocketman, representing Link Newcomb. Juan Alleman applies the polish. Ramon Sanchez does the steering. Seven, Valiant Livy, owned by Lana Merrick Bailey, prepared by Paul Jones, guided by Henry Lopez. Number eight, ain't he tempting? The property of Dun Ranch. Monte Rosa is the trainer. Armando Cervantes is astride. Racing! J. La Sultana is away cleanly, Valiant Livy likewise, Challenger an interesting eagle going fast near the inside and Ain't He Tempting is winding into his work down the middle of the track and has blasted clear, Ain't He Tempting, a debut winner from the outside gate, repeats in brilliant style, Challenger is in a three-way photo for the minor placings with interesting things officially 8-2-1-5. Ain't He Tempting continuing a spectacular start to his young racing career as this full brother to Golden State Derby winner Ain't She Tempting goes two for two for Dun Ranch. Monte Rosa, the winning trainer, Armando Cervantes is the winning rider. Ain't he tempting, a bay cult by Tempting Dash from the Corona Cartel Mayor Presley I. Bred in Utah by Macaulay Land and Livestock.